All right, we're still alive in it. We're still in it, my friends. We are nine in a row. Nine in a row. What is the next ship, and will it kill me? The drone delivery gamble. So many gambles that run. All right, let's see. Next ship. Random in three, two, one. Random. NGA. We don't do repeats. Three, two, one, and random. Already did Fed, Fed C, thank God, right? Right? Yeah, we've done that one. Three, two, one, random. The Mantis B. Okay, I have not done any Mantis ships. Used to be my favorite ship. I like the idea of this ship. Sadly, playing on hard, no pause is... Can be rough. Alright, Mantis B. Alright, I know I need to have Briggs as a Mantis border, so I'm gonna put him on the ship. Okay, does somebody, does somebody want to be the name of the ship? I feel like somebody wanted to be the name of the ship. It's gonna be Briggs. Who was it? Uh, you want to be a mantis? Alright, you can be the other one, Zayatia. Zayatia. You should be the name of all ships. Uh, it was a while ago. I think it was Grima. Was it Grima? I think it was Grima. We'll just call it the Grima. Here we go. I'm pretty sure it was Grima who said it earlier. On pause, this ship is very string of no pause. Stress city. Well, even with pause, it's like it depends on what ships you fight early game, right? Like if you fit not fight nothing but auto scout, you gotta like wait for boarding drone. You once jokingly said you want to be the ship. Well, it's I don't know. I don't know. It depends. If you get you can't name the ship at the beginning of the run, so. I mean, you you can only rename the ship at the beginning of the run, so... What's up, 90A? You hate this ship on no pause? And if it's Zoltan Shield ship, I can't do anything. Alright, let's see here. What do you got? Okay, we can board this. Three crew, boarding drone, into... Here. <clears throat> God, I hope that small bomb doesn't destroy us. I'm gonna go here. Are there any strats I need to be looking out for on this ship? Um, like, he, if he small bombs, like, my doors and then my O2 or something, that could really screw us over. Okay. Boarding drone should make the ship automatically S tier. <laughs> okay. You want to be future NG. Okay, Dimitrovsky. Remind me when I get an NG and I'll try to get you. Is my return to positions button easy hit? Yeah, it's enter. <coughs> Why? That's the default one, right? What do I upgrade? I think we have to get a weapon as quickly as possible, right? Like, we already have second shield. We like saving them in the teleporter so you can hit a button to start the fight and get them there. Oh, you like to start them here, save them here, and then move them to these other positions? <clears throat> That's probably better. Uh, I want to swap you, though. Not that it probably matters, but so save. You there, you there. Let's see if that works. If I do that, you should go to there. You get there quickly as possible. Okay. No, uh, in and all the crew already taken. Sorry, sir. Well, I hope it's not a Zoltan Shield ship. Okay. Oh, he's got mind control. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I can still send a drone over, I guess. I'm not sure if I can win this fight against mind control. How do I win this fight against mind control? 
keep sending boarding drones over. Late, god damn it. Okay, he's only got Oh god, what's the timing? I don't know. I'm going now. Before the mic troll comes back up, for the love of god, please. Got him, okay. Ooh, okay. <clears throat> And I have a double reward? Holy shnikes, that is so good. Free freaking NG. Man, that was crazy. I had to like time it, but halfway between mind control things after the heal. Yikes, mind control plus mantis anti-boarding, scary. Used a lot of drone parts, but it's okay. Best word possibly possible free NG? Yeah, I think so. Alright, so now I'm gonna say positions. Here and here, but I'm still going to start them out here so I can see what I'm boarding into. And they do that now, right? Yes. So NG is great. Now we need a weapon. Oh, okay. Um... Well, his weapons are crap, so I think I just wait this fight out and leave, right? We definitely don't give away crew. Yeah, just an empty jump depending on the bomb. Hopefully it's a stun bomb. If it's a stun bomb, we're safe. Small bomb is annoying, but fine. Well, not, not fine. Oh, Angie, save us, please. God damn it. Fucking two bombs in a row to shields. F U F T L. That's some bull shnikes right there. Fucking three bombs in a row. You piece of shit game, don't you do this crap to me. Three goddamn bombs in a row to shields. Okay, frickin' dodge it. Alright, I need to... I need to, like, he Oh, there's a fire in my sensors. the pirate, but I got a fire. <sighs> what do you think, Chad? Do we take this fight or not? I have no idea what the enemy is. I need to heal my dudes. I got a fire. I think I avoid. Seems takeable. Hensers aren't usable in Nebula. Yeah, but what if it's another Zoltan Shield ship? Very risky. Um, smuggler, you assume. Uh, okay, missile ship, we have defense drone. Two lasers, we have two shields. We have NG and plenty of hull. I do need to heal before boarding for sure. I'm gonna take this man. Okay, he's got a missile. All right. As long as we don't get super screwed, this is fine.
Pretty sure fire's all out. Okay. Okay, did that swap them? I think it did. Good job, defense drone. We're winning this. Okay, good. Very nice. Very, 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 very nice. Did an unwinnable fight that you'll run away from anyway, or a good fight? Well, that was what I was afraid of, was the unwinnable fight that I run away from. If it was like a flak one heavy laser ship, when I'm like... I mean, we do have two shields, but still, there could have been some fights that kill us there. No, I'm not going to pull it. <laughs> My poll is asking chat and then deciding for myself. You take that chance when you first open the game. Yeah, sure. Take the chance of dying every time you walk outside of your house, but it doesn't mean you try to hurry up upon your doom. All right, so I have... Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. I don't have a good way to do this, do I? This doesn't connect. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I do that to get as many jumps as possible. I go this way, look for a store that's, well, actually that connects. Okay. I end up here in seven. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, and this lets me see if there's a store over there. Okay, let's do that. To be fair, Flak Heavy Laser ends half the starting ships. Yeah, you're probably right. Okay, he's a missile teleporter. Okay, we be hero. We turn on our defense drone. Dot, dot, dot. Hopefully, profit. Crew sending his human over. Oh, I have a breach up there. Ha ha ha! Means I get to prevent the human. All right. Soften him up. We're tenderizing. It's all about if uh, defense drone fails here. Um, the rock crew is somewhere. Okay, we get ahead on the NG and we're good. Clever, leaving that breach. Yeah, I totally did that on purpose. On some five-head play. Or 2,000 IQ, or whatever the thing people say now. I have a free crew? Hmm. Delay. No, we want, just, we want guaranteed stuff. We've already planned out our jumps. Couldn't do this, though. Have I ever played RimWorld? I have. It's a good game. It's not my favorite, though. I don't like how punishing the game is, I say, as I play FTL. Uh, Paprik, you've been watching my streak since my personal best. Finally made it to the stream. Well, welcome. Glad to have you from the YouTube. We're on our third best uh, streak so far right now. So we're going to see if we can get to our second best here. As long as you don't have a system up there, the breach is actually another outside vent, which is great. Uh, I don't know. I don't like leaving pet breaches. Because if I ever have a situation where there's a breach in a room that I do want to get rid of, and I don't have level 2, and, and I have level 02, 202, and I have to do a bunch of micro to close doors, I don't know. I'm, I think Necro leaves breaches behind. I don't like to do that. Seven, six. So I do want to go there and then around. Okay. Normally you'd go NG's, engines three, but with an N, NG, you don't. Okay. Pirate disruptor. Hacking. You know what? If, if he has a boarding drone, I probably want to use a defense drone. Do I want to use defense? What do you all think? Do I use defense drone for hacking slash boarding drone or no? I'm leaning towards what hack really screws me. Um, shield hack wouldn't be terrible if it's only a basic laser. Teleporter hack would be annoying. Heal bay hack would be bad. Or 
Hoarding drone this early on likely, you think? Um, Anti-personnel drone is probably more likely than boarding drone. All right, I'm going to not defense drone. Three crew. If only level one of teleporter a boarding hack would make it pretty hard to win. I don't know what drones he has. Repair drone. Okay, weapon hack. Perfect. All right. Um, I could send a boarding drone over. I don't think I need it. Board here, kill the Zolt, and run away to heal. Actually, do we even need to run? Let's play it safe. I want to play it safe. I don't think I need to. But I'm to do it just because I'm not risking my crew. I meant to go there. This enemy has about a 50% chance of level 3 drones. So it is possible for them to have a boarding drone. Too bad killing repair drone gives no training. You know what? I don't know if I knew that. Killing repair drone doesn't give you training, huh? I actually want to test that. Nice. You're right. I don't think I knew that. Today I learned. <clears throat> Do I like the pickle in the McDonald's cheeseburger? I do not like pickles, so I would have to say no. All right, so we're hoping for... A, we should have a guaranteed store up here, right? Because I haven't seen one. So hopefully a decent chance of finding a weapon. Yeah, I can't stand pickles. Sorry for all you pickle lovers out there. All right, so the only way to kill this is boarding drone. Uh, please don't be separated rooms. Okay, yes. All right, well, everybody get ready for um, story time. Although small bomb could still be annoying. Oh, Jesus. F you, FTL. All right, well, this is still going to... Be annoying. I think we still take this. He'll eventually run out of missiles. As long as he doesn't small bomb my shields three times in a row again. Okay, doors is not fine, but we'll take it. Hell, man. God, small bombs are just being really annoying so far this run. I mean, this is, I think he has 20. I don't know, I think they have max 15, but... Yeah, that's fine, we don't care about that. NG has been huge this run, though. NG has already saved us a lot. The ship has 10, Mike Copley says. Well, there you go. Somebody can count and see if Mike's right. I would probably guess he's right. Okay, hates my doors. Once he runs out of missiles, then we could do story time. Oh, God. Okay, you know what? Heal yourself. I don't want you to die to the small bomb. No fire. Good. Well, we're farming repair training right now. <laughs> and it's working. Now I want some dodge training. Alright. Uh, well, actually it's down because he hit that, so. Just on NGA run, you know how he acts when confronted with a pickle. What? Uh... Empty room, small bomb, you love to see it. Looks like they're out. Bomb went down before weapons were damaged. Oh, did it? Okay. Well, I wasn't counting, so I don't know. I don't know that we got much in the way of dodge training. He's got two dodges. Yeah, I don't think we got any dodge training, actually. Oh, this could have taken longer. Wasn't actually too bad here. 
There are a few ships that have six missiles and a few that have 14. But most ships have 10. I guess is what you're saying, Mike. Yeah, we did get the repair train, so that is good. And we didn't take damage, so I'll take it. Ooh, double reward is very nice, though. All right, store. Weapon. We need a weapon. All right, no weapon and no Zoltan Shield bypass. What are we getting on this ship? We're getting hacking, we're getting cloaking, we're getting mind control. Old Rand got mind control because I like that with boarding. However, probably just hacking, right? Uh, what's up, Hugzer? Please tell me how you're fighting for your life in easy mode while this guy plays hard mode, no pause. <laughs> what about combat drone to get through Zoltan shields? What do we think of that? Means I have to remove... Uh, replace my boarding drone with a combat drone so I can get through Zoltan shields, maybe? Third drone recovery arm for right, chance? No. Thank you for the prime sub, Hugs. I appreciate that. What else can boarding drone do for us? It can do giant alien spiders. We go clone bay. Clone bay kills auto scouts. Hacking deals with enemies with med bays or dangerous weapons. So we just need a Zoltan shield solution. Welcome, local looks. Boarding drone can kill auto scouts. Well, if I if I sell boarding drone and get hacking and clone bay, can I do both? Then we can kill them with clone bay. You'd go hacking and clone bay and sell the boarding drone. Can I go hacking and clone bay without selling it? 130? I can. I'm going to do clone bay. And I probably do hacking. Yeah, I think clone, hack, no sell. Although, selling boarding drone to get... Boarding drone and mantis pheromones to get combat drone get the resultant shields. Mm. You have a small chance. One, two, three, four of a second store of this sector. Do the hacking. I'm trying to decide if I sell anything else, though. If I'm not getting anything else, it's their purpose to sell. I think combat drone's too pricey just to use for Zoltan Shield. I'm kind of thinking the same thing. There's anti-drone for the boss. Uh, it's a little early for that. Don't need pheromones anymore, I don't think. Yeah, but what am I buying with it? Yeah, I don't like clone uh, offensive drone either. Watch the next three ships be Zoltan Shield. I hope not. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna go with this and not make any other choices right now. If we have another store. We can sell stuff and make some changes potentially. Some burst laser two. We can hack their heal bay. Do I want to hack their weapons? If I hack their weapons, board their weapons. I isolate the Mantis, delay the Burst Laser 2, or do I just hack the Heal Bay? Well, hacking the Heal Bay isolates them for even longer, actually. So I can 1v2 them in there. Um, but do I want to hack the weapons to stop the weapons? I feel like I should hack these weapons. Yeah, it looks like small bomb to me. 
I'm worried he gets out before we kill this guy is what I'm worried about with him hitting. Okay, good. Uh, oh, damn it. How low is your health? It's going to be really low, but I think we're good. Okay. Okay. Uh, hey. We are three-fourths of our way to three Mantis borders, though. That's pretty awesome. That's a great reward, man. That's so good. That's going to make a lot of our boarding a lot better, too. Oh, you think that was a stun bomb, was it? I didn't actually notice. If it was a small bomb, it would have fired at the same time as Bruce Laser 2. Oh, are those charge times the same? Okay. Um, now the question is, do I even need to be in sensors? Or do I just want to insta-board? I think I just want to insta-board with three crew and hacking. I think I don't need to have anybody in sensors anymore. Because my issue is if I do this, what I'm going to do... So I'm going to see what they have go, oh, it's not that bad. Hit T and I instantly board, and I will board with a single Mantis, and I don't want to accidentally do that, so. Okay, make sure I didn't miscount or anything, so we shouldn't be diving. Clone Bay gets some wiggle room, too, you think? Jump is empty. Remember how I used a phrase pipe dream on one of my streams? What does it mean? Oh, pipe dream. Pipe dream is an English phrase that means um, unattainable goal or something so far out of reach that it might as well not be possible. Like, I, I'm i going to... Tomorrow, it would be a pipe dream if I all of a sudden found a million dollars lying on the street. It's pipe dream. Okay, that is... Uh, this is really good dodge training ship. Even though these guys are not guys I want to dodge with, I'm gonna get some training here. A pike dream is finding a pike in the store. <laughs> That's right. Uh, this is like perfect dodge training, so I'm gonna at least get level one engines uh, piling on my NG here, I think. Three humans. Getting laid is a pike dream. Okay. <laughs> Apparently that comes from smoking opium pipes. Oh, a dream you have while being high on opium, huh? Okay. Imagine a hobbit puffing on a pipe, wistfully imagining what could have been. <laughs> Any story about a payphone? I don't know if I've... Have I ever used a payphone in my life? My gosh, maybe when I was in high school one time. I mean, I'm so old that back in high school... Cell phones didn't exist, or at least people had pagers more than they had cell phones. You know? I feel like I was going to tell a story earlier, and I forgot what it was. Something about... Uh, pipe dream, it's an interesting word. It's actually two words, but yeah, it's an interesting phrase. It's in English... What do you call those? Idiom? It's an idiom, I guess. Pagers were just coming out when you were in high school? Yeah. When I was in prison. Okay. Uh, okay, here's a story uh, to go along with talking about all the singing stuff I like to do. So when I was a kid, I think I've told this on stream before, but um, I, um, my favorite like Disney cartoon when I was a kid, Disney cartoon movie, was L The Little Mermaid because I loved all the Sebastian's songs, Sebastian the Crab, which apparently are they doing a live... Action Little Mermaid. I think I saw something about that on Facebook, which would be terrible. But uh, anyway, I loved Little Mermaid because I loved both of Sebastian's songs. And so we didn't have like, you know, uh, uh, like MP3 players. We didn't have CD players. I don't remember if I had a CD player when I was like four or five. Probably not. What I think I had was a little cassette tape that I played inside my uh, parents' living room. I put a walkie-talkie next to it and the other walkie-talkie out on my front porch and I would pretend my front porch was a stage and I would sing the Sebastian the Crab songs while dancing around on my front porch pretending I was acting out Sebastian the Crabs under the sea. So, you know, big brain using a using a cassette player and walkie-talkies to 
<laughs> Do some goofy kid acting stage dance thing. Live action Little Mermaid. I am? Am I? You remember one kid thinking he was the absolute bomb because he had, what, a pager <laughs> in high school? Yeah. Have I, did I ever make a pillow for it? No, I never did that. I don't, well, I pro well, as a kid, I probably did that. My little brother and I had bunk beds when I was a kid. And uh, I think we, I can't remember if one of us preferred to be on the top bunk or not. Oh, another thing I remember in high school. Um, one of my best friends, you know, when you're high, when you're high school, everybody wants a car, right? You, you turn 15, get your learner's permit. Then you turn 16, get your driver's license. At least that's how it is in Texas. Probably a lot of the U.S. Um, my first car was a... My dad got a an old, like, 1980-something Nissan Pulsar, which was this cool little red car. It's like a little sports car with a T-top. If you don't know what a T-top is, it's like... It's kind of like a convertible, but instead of the top coming back, there's these little hard shells that you pull off to have, like... It's kind of a convertible... You can't drive till you're 18 where you are? Oh, that's sad. Florida is 16 for learner's permit. But one of my best friends in high school, his parents said, if you if you choose when you go to college not to go to Baylor because Baylor is too expensive, we'll buy you a nice car. So instead of going to Baylor University, which is like super duper expensive, he went to the community college that I went to and his parents bought him a... Probably 1999, like Firebird, Pontiac Fire, Firebird or something. And he had this like dark green Firebird. And I was so jealous because he had such a nice car. So, uh, back in your day, having an MP3 player was the coolest. Do I have a story where I pretend to sleep but then heard something I wasn't supposed to hear? Mm, I don't think I have a story about that. Although when I was a kid, I had night terrors. So, when I was a kid, I would wake up screaming and my parents would have to come in and tell me that, you know, I'm not drowning in the ocean or whatever night terrors I was having. All right, I got level one engines piloting. That's fine. That's that's enough. Firebird's still a cool car. car. I think, was that what it's called? Firebird? Is that the one that's like the sports car looking Pontiac thing? Double reward? Nice double reward. Very nice. Right, we do need to... Yeah, we're not we're not jumping yet, so we do need to do this. A Nissan Pulsar. It's FTL foreshadowing. That was a high school, huh? <laughs> Night terrors are awful, awful as hell. Thankfully, I barely remember them. All I remember is that I will sometimes have these flashbacks where I have this fear of really deep ocean. I think that's called thassalophobia. What's crazy is I don't think I actually have that fear in real life. But like I'll wake up in a dream from a dream of like being stuck under the ice in water or some deep dark ocean where I can't see what's really far down there or something. Why do we murder our mantis? Because you need full health on your borders in case we fight three other mantis or something. The only way to fully heal them on uh clone bay ships. Uh, your last night involved a dream where, with your friend, you were running from a massive glacier that had no end. The friend was riding a bicycle. You were running on foot and sliding on the snow to speed up. Nice. It's a good dream. Investigate. We have a free crew? Nice. All right. Do I board with an NG? Do I have my NG stay over here for extra dodging? Honestly, I probably four-person board here. Go play Soma. What is Soma? Is that like a deep sea diving game or something? So Subnautica was a blast. Subnautica activates some of those fears. The fear of reapers in the deep dark below is pretty scary. NG or Zoltan? Uh, I don't want Zoltan shield chip, so let's go NG. What's up, Larry Serial? Is, this, is it still the big win streak? We're at nine in a row, my friend. Right? Is that right? Let me look at my title. Yeah, nine in a row. Third best streak so far. Okay. So all we're doing is looking for a store with weapons right now. Black one would be amazing. Heavy laser one would be great. Please rename the NG with your name. Thank you, Dimitrovsky. I'll get you right now. After this. Okay, he can damage us, but it'll take him a while. He has a heal bay. 
so we hack the heal bay. So here. Um... Uh, okay, so, you know what? I'm gonna have to. Do I need to refresh my crew? This is actually kind of annoying. Um, I need to get his weapons offline, actually, because this this thing can actually kill us. I should have let that through. Okay, okay. Now, once our shields respawn, we're okay. I'm gonna bring you guys back for now. I'm a little sketched out right now. Okay. One guy's repairing shields. Okay, we're safe now. Go so double Mantis in here when he runs, and we kill him before he gets through there. Beautiful. All right, man, Mantis with uh, NG Medbot dispersal is not fun. There's two stores. Do I re? If I'm gonna go to two stores, I'm not gonna heal my guys yet. Let me check one store to see if I need to heal them. Uh, it was a horror game, and you're in a research facility built at the bottom of the ocean. Oh, Soma is that? Okay. And Dimitrovsky wants to be the NG. There's some weapons. Very nice. Dimitrovsky. NG boarding? Yeah. Alright, so... Thinking about buying these two. Ion Blast to get through Zoltan Shield, and Ion Blast plus Heavy Laser 2 and hacking is not terrible? Maybe? Yeah, that ship had uh, NG Medbot Dispersal. Do I buy both of them? I buy this because I can have it online right now and I can deal with Zoltan Shield ships. I didn't check. Is there a Zoltan Shield Bypass? There's not. You'd just be grabbing Ion and then looking for a Small Bomb or Hermes, huh? I only have six missiles, though. Really? I just sell my boarding drone. How long, how much to get heavy laser two? Sixty plus forty, so about a hundred. I sell my boarding drone and mantis pheromones. I might be able to get the heavy laser online. You always wanted to ask if I my goal is to win with every ship. Doesn't matter if it's in a random order. Uh, that's why we do hard mode, no pause, random ship, no repeats. We just want to beat every ship once in a row before repeat. So we, we random until we die. And if we random a ship we've already played, we don't do repeats, so we go to another ship. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like Heavy Laser is not... Well, is it bad? I feel like it's a little greedy to not take another good weapon, right? How many jumps before this other store can we take? I can go like one, two, three, store, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to buy this. I'm gonna sell the Mantis Pheromones. Uh we're in NG sector. So we could get we could get giant alien spiders. Clone Bay does giant aliens giant alien spiders for us. I'm gonna sell that. But I'm not going to upgrade to it yet. Until I see what's at this door. So one, two, three, four. But I feel like buying the heavy laser and holding on to it is not bad. You think you have the animated flak bits emote done? Oh, nice. Can you link a picture to it on Imgur or something? Quest marker to my map. Okay, I can get that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You know what order it'll be in? You could do ship specific practice ahead of time. Yeah. They're just pirates. 
Okay, Burst Laser 2, do I want to hack? I think I can kill him fast enough, I don't need to hack. And I didn't heal my crew. That's okay. Nice! Oh, good fight. Alright, so one more jump and then store. Level 2 Clone Bay would not be a bad buy either, I think. Boarding drone reminds you of a horror movie in the 90s with a killing robot in a corporate building. Anyone know the name? <laughs> Robocop? I don't know. You say it as Imgur. Yes. And I say... What's the other thing that I say? Uh, I say GIF, not JIF. Because to me, JIF is peanut butter, so... You probably say Jeff, I'm guessing. The endless internet debate. Uh, empty jump is empty. It's a soft G. The burst laser one is just easier to get online. Do I sell beam drone? Do I keep it for phase three of the boss where we get through the Zoltan shield faster? Mm, we're still hoping for drone recovery. I'm not drone recovery. I'm, um... Sultan Shield Bypass anyway. Fact, not opinion. Great. Do I buy Burst Laser 1 because it's easier to get online than Heavy Laser? No, I'm not doing Vulcan, I don't think. Cell Beam 1, get Burst Laser. Beam Drone helps cut through Sultan Shields. True, Ion plus Beam Drone does get through Sultan Shields pretty quickly. I guess I could hold on to Beam Drone until we get Zelda Shield Bypass, maybe. I think I do want to buy this, though. Although if I sell Beam Drone, I feel like I'll be able to get my weapons actually online quicker. Hey, thank you for the uh, four months in a row and eight months of subage side. I appreciate that. How much did you get that online? So 40... I'm gonna sell it. I'm gonna do that. That's also a value point, or I can use Burst Laser 1 if I think it's useful. Um, to repair. I'm just gonna do this. Twenty-five scrap does not seem worth losing a tactical option here. Okay. Well, too bad I did it. Too bad. I don't know. Like, honestly, I think this is going to be about as good as Beam Drone getting through Zelt in speed of getting through Zelt and Shields. Right? Like, I feel like, depending on their dodges, this is about the same time. So I don't... I don't regret getting that online. Happy Pi Day. Oh, it's 314, isn't it? You're right. Oh, that's Clo... Clone Bay Missile... Um, way to go that thing. Let's see if we just can hit this. Actually, I'm going to go for that. As soon as the guy dies, we can go there. Do this. Let's not stun our own crew. Okay, no level 2 Columbia. Very nice. What we're hoping for now is one more mantis for maximum dismemberment. That would be great. Uh, speaking of, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna vent the two low health mantis. Sadly, the other guys, I will not vent. I feel like with four person teleporter, I don't quite need to refresh every guy to max health every time. I don't know if Britnoff might do that because he always thinks. Talks about venting everybody for full health every time, but with four-person border, I teleport. I feel like it's not as crucial. How is training going so far? Uh, our pilot is, is at level one. My fighters, I don't know. They're probably doing pretty well. All but our latest one is at level one training. The level three clone bay, you'd also not need to vent everyone as often. Yeah, I'm not spending the scrap to do that, though, yet. Oh, smoldering NG research station. 
FTL smoldering into research station. You can tell I forget this one because I... Yeah, crew member Clone Bay protects us. This is the cannibals. Yeah, Clone Bay protects us. We're good. Save the NG, save the drone, save yourselves. Um, What do we like here? Crew on a boarding ship is great. I already have two NGs, though. I'm honestly leaning towards drone schematic. What are the rewards? Let's look. NG is... Low scrap plus drone schematic. Low scrap, save yourselves. NG is crew member, low scrap. So it's either crew and low scrap or drone schematic and low scrap. Free hull repair drone would be pretty nice. Yeah, and you can sell the drone schematic. So drone schematic is definitely more scrap potential. All right, let's go drone schematic. <laughs> well, there's that beam drone to help get through Zoltan's shield. I knew I was getting that. It's totally why I did that earlier. Beam drone will not leave us alone. All right, let's see what we got here. Three fuel for two drone parts? Nah. Zoltan or Uncharted Nebula? So I don't have long-range scanners. I do have okay weapons to kill auto scouts, and we can board auto scouts, potentially. Uh, Zoltan controlled. We now have the beam drone and these weapons to get through Zoltan shield. How well do we deal with border police? We have four crew in a clone bay, probably. Nebula for more scrap. I would, if I had long range scanners, I'd go uncharted nebula. No, no, uh, no question. Do I have other stuff to sell? Not really. Thirteen fuel. Uncharted has more options at sector four. Well, it has two red options. So, do I want red or red or purple or red? What is the worst event in FTL? The one that has your whole border police. Uh, border police is one of the worst. The slug one where they get free hack on your heel bay and uh, and free boarding sucks. Any Lanius Bomber. I'm gonna go Nebula. I know, Force Green or Force Purple. I'm gonna go here and then I'll have a choice of reds, I think. Field Hack Event in Sector 1, that could be arguably the worst because it happens that you're most vulnerable too. But it's actually really bad anywhere, so yeah. Rock Live Mine? That's a bad one. I insta board here, I don't think he'll board at all. Should just win this fight. Keep their health spaced out. Alright, well we got plenty of fuel now. Go ahead and uh, vent the two lowest health dudes. Fuel hack anywhere is bad, bad, bad. I think they made the Zoltan Eye unskippable and just a dice roll, it would be the worst. That's a pretty bad one. Shield Hack Sector 1 can be terrible. Shield Hack Sector 1 is so bad that me, Kasalian, and I think Freddy or Pie Boy or one or two others considered making that the only event where we allow a reset in the tournament a year and a half ago, two years ago, whenever we did it. That's how bad Shield Hack Sector 1 is. We were considering making a special circumstance of that being a, a free allowed reset. And I can't remember what our choice was. I think we made it um, player's choice on that. Yeah, you vaguely remember that, Farb? Yeah. All right, half power. Manually search. We got clone bait. <laughs> you know, it goes great with a anti-ship beam drone. Another anti-ship beam drone. I love anti-ship beam drones. It's my favorite. Do I want to upgrade anything right now? Like hacking, maybe?
probably. Probably worth. Flagship event is pretty bad. You have to win it to beat the game. Really tough requirements. True. It's true. Good point. Chase them. Uh, all right. At least it's in a nebula. Probably dive this sector two with a nebula dive. Just need Ion Blast 2 and Drone Recovery Arm. We can pivot to being a superior NGA build. There you go. Wow. Well, you know, you know what I'd like? To have any ship fights. Okay, here we go. Um, I'm considering if I use a defense drone or not. If I do this... I wait to see if the missile fires or if we kill them quickly enough. Damn. Oh, who wanted that fourth mantis? Because I'm right there with you. Beautiful. You are now our engines. We have this. This right here is why this used to be my favorite ship in the game. Four man mantis boarding is just. Oh, amazing, man. Amazing. I love this build. All right. And this plus mind control is just insane. That's why I used. That's why I used to get every time I played this ship was four mantis board. Well, every time I I would try to get this, four man mantis boarding plus mind control. You DM'd the gift. Oh, okay. Uh, I should show it on stream. Let me pull it up real quick. Hold on a second. Let's see if we can look at it. We can all look at it together. DM the flak gif. All right, here we go. Let's see what it looks like. <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, so it's like a black square. Is there any way that we can make it? Uh, what's the word? Transparent? So that there's... Will this be transparent or not? It should be transparent. Okay. Okay, cool. I will have to try to upload that and see if that works. That's going to be one of our emotes, yes. All right. Thank you for that. That's awesome, uh, Bilbo Saggins. Right. Okay, we actually want to get as many jumps as possible here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, let's go here. It is transparent. Uh, Giphy you adds a black background to gifts that are transparent. Awesome. That is super cool. With our flak U plus that, that's going to be fun. Damn, he doesn't have level 1, so we take damage here. Okay. Uh, let's go here now. Taking damage again. Can I get that first laser offline? Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, we're good. We're good. Three pike beam. Nice. Looks like the bot's on vacation. Oh, um, okay. Bot is now back to work. I'll need to upload that uh, and set. Do you need three different sizes for GIF emotes? I don't know. For um. For non gif emotes, you need multiple sizes. I don't know if that's required for gif emotes. And Farb sent you the assets. Thank you for the help, Farb. Awesome. We're gonna have we're gonna have flying flak as one of our uh, emotes. That's great. I'll probably call it. What will we call it? Because we already have a what is it? A rand flak emote. Is that what the other one's called? Rand 118 flak. Rand 118 flak. So I'll have to make it Rand 118 one, 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 one something. I don't know. Okay. Uh, whoa, I have two. I have an NG on top of each other. How did that happen? Okay, that was weird. I think that's a bug that I've not noticed before. Okay, all right. Um, what are we trying to do? We're trying to find a store. Okay. Hmm. 
66 scrap. I have two beam drones. Pike. Yeah, okay, we have stuff to sell. Let's go. We love getting vent refreshed. We all need the fresh air. They were simply attempting to achieve an NG and Mantis Union. All right, well, we do want backup battery. Do I ever want Pike Beam? Well, we're definitely taking this because that's our final system. Thinking about the anti-drone for phase two of the boss. Are we ahead enough now that I can sell Pike Beam for anti-drone for phase two of the boss? Yeah, yes, it was a bug. Yes, as they blush furious, uh, furiously. That's funny. What what drone would I want more? Probably hull repair drone is the best one to find. I mean, maybe I get nothing and just try to get this heavy laser online. Heavy laser, burst laser one. We can make that happen right now. I think I'm going to do that. I feel like we're at one of these places in a run where we're strong enough that pretty... We have a lot of freedom for what we can do here. They were hugging. That's what they were doing. Yes, they were hugging very... Huggily. I want to buy one fuel. Okay. All right, so I plan on diving. So I need to be here in six, six, five, four, three, two, one. Yes. Because we can hack weapons and board weapons for the board, and we should be pretty safe for boarding. Gotta do this. I did that a little early, honestly. But we're good. Man, four man mantis boarding is so fun. Ooh, good do Dumbledore doge. Oh, a free ion stunner. Okay. Uh, you go ion blast plus ion stunner. I don't know that I want to do that, honestly. One power lets me do this and this. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Stunner is kind of useful for boarding. Unless we're boarding in shields to pull them, then we're stunning everybody. Is is it that useful? And I guess I can have it on my bar because it's just a better ion blast, but how do you use it when you have four mantis boarding that are just gonna destroy everybody? Could go here. Um, I could just not dive. One, two, three, eh. Pretty much committed to the dive. I have not seen if that's a store. The question is, do I want a chance at another store here? I don't think we get any more stores this sector except empty beacons. So one, two, three, four, I think is better. Fire, time, running out of the room perfectly, and prey. Okay, all right. Okay, is he... he's not running, at least. I'm gonna not board this. Everything fires at the same time, which is good for us. Okay, pretty good dodges. Damn, he's gonna get multiple shots off before we fire his knee. Okay, no more weapons for you, bro. That was painful. Ouch. Oh, I need auto fire off. All right, we took a little damage there. Uh, whoops. That's fine. Those were really good weapons with level two cloaking, I think. So, I'm waiting for the hack. Pretty darn strong ship, honestly. All right, I want to get level two engines and then start saving up for some shields potentially, but I kind of need power first. All 
Although we do have backup batteries, so I might just go to level two engines. Let me see if there's a store there before I do it. Uh, you know what? I'm going to buy six fuel here. I'm going to buy the max amount of fuel. Boarding ships love to run out of fuel. They just love it. Okay. 17 scrap. Okay. Four, four missiles. I don't know how good of a deal that was, but okay. Okay. So, one more jump, then we're diving into the exit beacon, and we're hacking weapons, boarding weapons. Nice, we got a ship fight out of this. Zoldan shield ship, though, okay. Uh, he can't damage us, but I do have to deal with this guy. Perfect. Uh, we got a map. Hey guys, have you ever seen a more useful map than this right here? Look at this gorgeous map. Sure, I'm glad I have a map. Gotta love the freaking troll map when we're already diving. What a troll map. All right, since I know I'm gonna be fighting um, probably pretty strong dudes here, let's get you refreshed and you refreshed. Wow, I know. We got a map, enough map for years. What a great map. <laughs> hey, look at the flak bits. They're gorgeous. I love them. No. <laughs> I said flak bits. Uh, the flak, the, just the flak, the bits of flak. Sure, they're flak bits. Okay, so we need to... Yeah, so my goal is on this fight is going to be to board weapons, hack weapons, destroy his weapons. Just do all the things to weapons so he can't do any damage to us. If he's got multiple offensive drones or boarding himself, that might be an issue. You know, I'm going to start in, in doors just in case we need to deal with some boarding dudes. Do want to get anything before the dive? No, I don't think so. I know, so many revealed beacons. So many. Oh, he even has a... Man, I not, might not even need to hack that. But I think, uh, will I anyway? Actually, I'm going to hack Heal Bay. That'll probably even make this kill even easier. I'll lock them out, and if they do get in, we just hack it, and they'll run back out. Man, I love four-man Mantis boarding. So good. Thanks for the fuel. All right. Uh, I want to get level two clone bay next, I think. You want to make a dark joke about maps? It's probably a good idea if you don't do it. Hey, you're growing. You're growing. They won't live long enough for Vulcan to be a threat. I know. Uh, Rebel or rock? Or forced green or forced purple? We have uh, rock live mine protection in clone bay. Um, if we have Force Zoltan, how bad would that be? Rebel 4 can be pretty dangerous. Double offensive drone ships are there. Yeah, what is that? Um, auto, auto assault ships. And it's true, we do have defense drone for rock controlled. Wow, are we actually taking rock? I think we do take rock. I think y'all have convinced me rock is actually better here. We have... Clone Bay for Rock Live Mine. We have Defense Drone for Missiles. All right. Um, fighting against Rocks is not my favorite for my borders, but I'll let you get refreshed here. Is Rebel Control more likely to have auto ships? Yes, it is. Did I keep a beam drone? No, I did not. I sold all of them. Well, two beam drones and a bike beam, I think. 
still have the Ion Blast. Okay. What's my next buy? Is my next buy just Clone Bay Protection, maybe? We have all of our systems. Hey, freaking, yeah, nice double reward. Okay, since I don't see store, I'm gonna go Clone Bay for that protection. And now, third shield or more dodge. One of those two, I think. And the music rocks. Thanks, thanks, Inan. Thank you. Empty jump is empty. Store with 27 scrap and an ion blast to sell. I could get long range scanners. Um, if not that, a little fuel and repairs. I think I will. The music is good, though. You're not wrong. Uh, it was also a chance for Zoltan Shield Bypass, wasn't it? Double defense drone is, like, never worth. It's easy to make the music for granite. Take the music for granite. All right, I guess it's rock pun time. Okay. All right, I'm hacking his heal bay. So we just can't get in there. I'm hoping I don't need to use a defense drone. Hoping that I kill him quickly enough. So much health, man. Looks like that's a breach bomb. Nice! Didn't even need to use it. Beautiful. How's our health? We have level 2 clone bay. I'm going to be... More generous about not venting them all the time. You do know that The Rock's favorite Earth Band is The Rolling Stones. This music do be smashing. I'd make a rock pun if I were a bit bolder. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, uh, where's, where's Pie Boy and Shogi to allow all these puns? Because I'm trying to not allow them anymore. All right. What's wrong? Please, can I not have five free hole damage again today? Damn it. That is two five free hole damages we've gotten from that event today. You were thinking about a Rolling Stone joke, but you weren't sure how to make it start rolling? I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not good at puns. All right. Um, we've seen one store. Seven, six, five. I need to be here in five. Okay, okay wow. So many uh, asteroid fields in this sector. I'm being very greedy and not hacking. But we do kill them pretty quickly, so... Ooh, I shot their heavy ion down with my laser. Planned, everybody. Completely planned. Calculated. Let me see if I want to refresh my two low health mantis. Yeah, I should. Completely and utterly calculated. Okay. Alright, we got a lot of scrap. Uh, so we can probably go for a third shield next, I'm guessing. What's the salt shaker? It's my saltiness meter. <laughs> uh, now that is called a bit cup. It's if people donate bits, which is a way to tip the streamer on, on, uh, on Twitch. Um, it's a way to interact with the stream, basically. Oh, that is a lot of weapons. Okay, I'm gonna hack the weapons. Aboard the weapons. I'm gonna hack them. And I hopefully got everybody. Everybody's stuck in here. Nobody else is trying to get in. Beautiful. 
probably never going to get this engine ng this ng engine training unless I find a very good ship for that. It's empty and upside down. I must be unsalted right now then. Uh, sure. <laughs> Honestly, on this run compared to previous runs, yes. Um, I'm going to get one dodge and one engine. I like, I like to get three engines before I get my third shield. Oh. Saying it's empty makes people want to fill it with salt bits. Thank you, Mr. Breadbats, for the salt bits. Okay. So if that's a store, would I want it? I think so. One, two, three, four. It'd be really funny if we donated bits to make the FTL game more salty. I don't know about that. Oh, there's a free rock crew. Yes, nice. For once, I'm probably actually going to take this crew. Because I think the reward is crew and... I think scrap. First time the Salt Shaker appeared, people couldn't get enough trying to get all the bits to be sent flying with the 10,000 bit donation, yeah. Okay. Yay, Solar Flare Free Rock Borders, my favorite. Uh, one of the worst events in the game. Well, this isn't that bad. This is just an annoying event because you gain nothing from it. Okay, and it is a store. All right. All right, 119 scrap. Search laser's okay. We know we're getting a free rock crew next sector, so I don't need to buy one. We're really just looking for result and shield bypass now, right? I don't think I care enough for a charge two. Like if there's a flak one or a burst laser two, I'd can I'd probably get it. Uh let's see here. Alright, demand the surrender of their goods. Big giant missile. We're gonna see if I don't if I need to use a drone part or not. I'm guessing I probably won't. He doesn't have a heal bay. Well, that might be a Hermes. Looks like it's actually charging decently fast. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Ooh, okay. That was gonna get a free rock. I wasn't expecting it from there. Rock, you have weapon training. That's perfect. Alright, sadly we need to refresh all these dudes. They're all too low. And Breach Bomb. What about a Breach Bomb? I don't have one yet. I'm going to get Third Shield, but I want to see if there's an early store next sector before I make that purchase. We're definitely going late today. Uh, I will say that second run, Stealth B run, I was... I'm being a lot more deliberate with a lot of my decisions, so... I honestly might need to change... My normal FTL Harbo no pause full day to Tuesday, so I'm not stressed about having rehearsal on Wednesday right after. So you know what? Next week, this might be a permanent change to do make Salt Day be Tuesday instead of Wednesday. Because of how much longer these runs can go and I'm being more deliberate with my choices. You like that I have a stun bomb on my ship. It tri truly has stunning power. Do I have a stun bomb on my ship? I don't have a stun. I have an ion stunner. Okay, so that's the free Ariadne Grande event thing there. Means we can do five or six runs on Tuesday. Yeah, <laughs> totally. Alright, empty jump is empty. Salt day is best day, huh? My auto scout. <coughs> I only have four shots here. So I think I need to hack shields and shoot piloting and shields, maybe. There's a two. Um. 
I don't think I want a board here. Actually, I'm going to go all in on weapons. If I can get his weapons offline, then I could safely board and... What? What? Why did I only hack level one? What the hell is wrong with me? Well, that was an absolute misplay. I might need to run here. It's only a basic laser, but... Why did I... Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, okay. All right. Stuff's back up. Let's wait for the cloak. I need to get my level 2 hacking up. I do not know if I want to stay in this fight. If this ion hits, I'm running. Okay, let's get out of here. Screw it. Uh, I, I messed up my first shot. Crap, I'm running with no shields, though. Okay, well, that's fine. He's going to board us. I'm going to hack his weapons. <clears throat> I think he's a lot of drone parts these last couple fights. I do not like how this has been going. I feel like I did not play this super well. Beautiful. Okay. All right. Not the best couple of fights there, but I feel like those enemies were both... Well, this one wasn't that strong, but the last guy was strong. How many ships are there? There's 28 FTL ships. So 28 in a row is what we're going for. The longest streak says in the title, personal best of 18. I mean, yes, 18. So 10 away from the full streak. Yeah, he's attacking and a defense drone there. Um, weapon upgrade 75. A little power starved right now. Let's do this. Don't want a bunch of auto scouts, and I feel like that's what's being really annoying. So, attack here. You're stuck in here with me. Beautiful. All right. Good fight. Hack weapons, board weapons, kill weapons, execute humans in weapons. All right. We're looking for stores for Zoltan Shield Bypass. Seeing that that's not a store. Go one, two, yeah, and across. Okay. I died on Zoltan Sea on the 19th try. Wow, you remember that? Okay, uh, this is an auto scout. Oh, come on, game. Oh, god damn it. Good dodge, though. Good dodge. Fucking hell, man. Okay, uh, you fix that. Uh... Can't do any damage, man. I need freaking power. Uh, if I do this, his drones will be repaired slower. I don't know if I can kill this guy, man. Um, come on. Okay, okay. Okay. Now he's got three shields online. Okay, great. Hmm. Actually, might need a drone to be online for us to... 
get all these hits in so that his shields go down in power. Yeah, I know, backup battery. I know, I'm, I'm using it when it's ready, but... We need a full volley to hit. Wow, he has the shields and that drone online. Seriously? Okay, no more dodges. Okay, we're good now. Okay, all right. One more shot and we're good. All right, annoying fight. It's all right. Only use one drone part. We got there. Scary auto scout. Yeah, I mean, the, the problem with the fights like this is that the enemies... In half power nebulas, always have like 8,000 extra power. It's just ridiculous how much extra power they have. Uh, 5, 10, 15, 16. I'm going to get one more power. So in this nebula, I have one more power to work with. Probably need to get this ion center up soon. My weapons are honestly not that good. They're okay with hacking, but when I don't have enough power to power everything. Free crew, yes, please. Uh, we're actually... You know what? I might need to seriously consider... I'm full crew now. I might need to consider turning in our rock passenger for the free weapon we're going to get for that. I, I might look that up to see what the more scrap, the higher scrap gains is. Boarding ships don't need weapons. Well, they do need Zoltan Shield Bypass, which we don't have yet. That ship would have terminated you. You're learning a lot watching. Nice. Don't shield bypass. No. Hermes. We did learn the value of Hermes plus teleporter plus hacking last week. Is it worth getting with 12 missiles? That one shots uh, boss missile, right? We hack piloting. Hmm, how would we how would we board boss with Hermes? We kill the side rooms. We hack piloting. We Hermes the missile. Yeah, I'm thinking about this Hermes. Thinking about it. Side room board, Hermes missiles, yeah. What weapon do I sell for it? Probably the Ion Stunner. Just hack the missile and Hermes missile it. We won't have cloaking. We'll have defense drone. Yeah, that's true. Maybe we can take zero missile shots. Would be amazing. Thunder grip result and shield removal. Oh, too late. I sold it. One, two. How many jumps? I have five. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Let me get. How much does Elden Shield bypass cost? Anybody help me remember? One, two, three, four, five. I could do that. I think it's 50. 55. Uh, I don't take that deal. Oh my god, just nothing but empty jumps. All right, let me see what the... Um, let me see what the reward is for the Numa 5 passenger quest. All right. Um, and or over refuse to comply. Um, FTL hand her over. So if I hand her over, I get an augment and low scrap. 
If I refuse to comply, I get crew member, medium scrap. Oh, I get high scrap with resources. I get high scrap if I crew kill. So if I crew kill, I have to vent somebody, but I get high scrap. Do I want to augment or high scrap? Um, augment or high scrap. What are the, we could get a free pre-igniter, couldn't we? Can we get a free pre-igniter? It's like random augment, isn't it? Free pre-igniter, free Zoltan Shield bypass. High scrap is 42 to 51, low is 16 to 23. Yeah, Augment is either amazing crap or something in between. It could be one of any of those. Uh, since I had to vent crew, I'm leaning towards the free Augment. Let's get the free Augment. Scrap recovery arm. Okay. All right. Godly, right, everybody? It's a godly Augment. I don't know. Do I sell it? If I don't get anything from selling it, I might not sell it. Might have some value. There's reconstructive, long range scanners, no Zoltan Shield bypass. That's a flak, though. Okay, okay. Um, Hermes, flak, heavy laser, too. I think that's going to be our build, maybe? Long range scanners. I could have long range scanners and scrap recovery arm for the last two sectors. That could be really good scrap gains. Here we go, flak burst heavy. I could. I kind of like the idea of the Hermes, though, I think. I'm not going to be able to buy fuel if I do that. You say burst laser one for later flagship phases? No. Oh. oh, well. Uh, my fuel is not in great shape. Fuel is not in great shape. But I'm doing that. I'm doing that because I like it. Look for the ship. We pursue double. Doesn't matter about the exit beacon. Nice. Hey, and we even got four fuel from it. Beautiful. But long range scanners, I got him. Long range scanner, scrap recovery arm, I got him. All right, we have two more sectors worth of potential scrap gains here. Okay, Slug or Zoltan? Um, it's all, never Zoltan, right? I don't have the mind control counter for Slug. I do have the Mantis oversee the repairs for the troubling radiation thing. You know what? I'm going to go there just to kill the Slugs that want to hack my clone bay. Slug is 450 to 500 scrap. We also have long range scanners and a scrap recovery arm, so I'm hoping for some very big gains here. There's a store. Zoltan is dangerous, yeah. All right, that's a heal bay. I'm going to hack. Double ion pike beam, huh? Okay, we're going to board weapons, hack weapons. You know what the natural predator of a slug in its natural habitat is? Frickin' four mantis borders get blasted. I learned that from... Um, David Attenborough. I'm sure he said that on some show or something. A salty rand. Okay, that is too. <laughs> Info you've tracked is that Zoltan and Slug are two of the sectors that benefit most from long-range scanners. Zoltan is actually top, although the sample size isn't enormous. What's the difference between friendly and hostile sectors, basically? More encounters, less stores? Yeah, green sectors generally have more stores. Red sectors generally have less stores and more fights. That's general... Um, most 
experienced FTL players prefer to go to civilian sectors versus scrap games. This is a really spread out, terrible layout. Oh my god, this is to be here in eight. Oh, what a bad layout. Okay, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. God, this is about as bad of a layout as you could possibly get from a sector, plug sector. I know, forced layout is so dumb. Only because this is the difference between friendly and hostile sectors is the color. All right, let's just go to the store. Looking for the Dolan Shield Bypass. Nope. There's a whole repair drone. Do we buy the whole repair drone? On the boss fight? I think yes. I think I, I'm i going to buy a drone part, too. And I'm going to buy two fu three fuel. All right, next goal. Gain lots of scrap. Get level three hack. Get fourth engine. Get weapon upgrade. Point being, people see the colors and think, oh, it ought to work like this, and it doesn't. Okay. Right. Which I had Zoltan Shield Bypass here, but it's fine. His weapons aren't the worst. 12 seconds and 16, so his first volley doesn't perfectly line up, I don't think. Uh, well enough. Nope. Okay, good. Come on. Do this to lock them out of the heal bay. Good. Good. Generally, it's still being sort of generous, though. It's best to know the genera patterns to each sector type. Yes. You, you want to know what your chances are for things to happen, that's for sure. You know what, I'm in a slug home nebula and I haven't done? I haven't gotten level 202. That was, could have been bad. All right, we're fine. It's fine, it's fine. Two, three, four, five, six. I can get seven there, but there's not an efficient way to do it, is there? Well, I might back backtrack for store. You know what, I'm going to let him board first. His weapons are kind of crap, and I'll be 4v2 if I let him board first. Hacking over here. He'll board over here. Okay. Well, hey, good dolphin flipping. Nice. I need to refresh them, dudes, but that was good practice for if I was like Heal Bay or something. Dolphin flip saved them. Now it's time to kill them. It's a brave man to ship with a three shot barrage, no medical unit in Sector 6. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, look, we're Mantis Bomber versus Mantis Bomber. Who will win? My vote's for Mantis Bomber. I need to refresh some dudes. Kills for Mantis. It's what you signed up for. I don't know. They signed the waiver. Before coming on my ship, it said, Do you consent to being repeatedly cloned for no apparent reason after being thrown out of an airlock? If answer yes, welcome aboard. If no, what are you doing in life? Great time. You did. Yeah, see, side shit. Signed it. Signed it. Signed, sealed, delivered. All right, let's get fuel and one drone part. And I've seen two stores in nebulas, and I don't have any jumps that are non nebula. So let's get level three hack. I have any way to get five, not efficiently. You love those bombers that don't even have a bomber bomb on them. Very bomber. 
right. Very bomber of them. All right. Um, I will have to vent a crew, so I'm gonna do the long range scanner. So okay. Well, it's an engines guy. Uh, Dimitrowski, I think I have to get rid of you. You're my only. Uh, actually, let's see. You're on shields, aren't you, Nellis? Yes, you are. Okay, we'll get rid of Nellis. Dimitrowski, you dodged the bullet. You dodged the bullet, sir. Teleporter blue option strictly better there. Is it? Uh, I thought they were both crew and chance for scrap. Okay, well, I'm not, I'm never going to remember that. FTL lock on to to their life signs crew member and medium scrap uh oh so i had a chance for medium scrap there but teleporter is crew member and scrap yeah i, I probably am not gonna remember that i'll try to remember that teleporter better for that one event out of five thousand try to remember that Keep going in my ear. Use a defense drone. You know what? I do not want to use a defense drone. I want to save a drone part. I'm going to be greedy. Take the missile. Take two missiles. Nope. Only one. Not bad. If I traded two health for one drone part there. Is that worth? Uh, it might be worth. Uh, yeah, I just got them all. Uh, there's never a long-range blue option that beats a teleporter blue option. Okay, that's, that's, that's something I could try to remember. If there's ever teleporter and blue option, teleporter's always better. Is that the only event that has that? Is that the only one that applies? I have a feeling that might be the only one that applies, but I don't know. Considering the drone would totally miss that missile was a good choice. It did hit my shields, you're right. That was probably probably gonna be the the bug. The defense drone bug. I think that is actually the only event, but Teleporter is always better than long range scanner. I don't know how many times that will come up, but I will hopefully remember that. Are the new clones called refreshments? You you are welcome to call them that. Oh, I thought this is the one where the mantis give me a blue option. Well, damn it, kill them. Okay, his weapons can't get through our shields though, so. Um, perfect. There's probably fire in there, too. Careful with my clone bay, I know. I might need to send more borders over there. Oh, that's a fire. Beautiful. See his Elton, nice. Yes, sadly. Wait, didn't we already? Oh wait, you know what? I don't have an RPG Nerdos. I thought somebody asked to be the Elton Shields, and I think that might have been the last run. So there you go. Um, another ship fight. We need to. We need to clone. I want to get level three clone by. I want to get dodge. I also want to get my weapon up upgraded. Um. I'm going to do that, and I'm going to refresh the low health guys, but not the super low health guys. I'm not getting vented, I'm just taking some air lock. <laughs> That's a good way to look at it. Good way to look at it. Other blue options can be better than teleporter, potentially. Okay. But teleporter is always better than long range scanners, and I'm totally, totally, totally going to remember that. Totally. OK, 
Okay, he can do damage, but only if he's very lucky with timing. And what is that, 25 and 10? I don't think he'll ever get that lucky with timing. Man, I love four mantis boarding, have I mentioned lately? That's four mantis that just beat six slugs. Get wrecked. Even with us refreshing. Although I, I didn't refresh two of them. Four mantis boarding, so stinking good, man. So our main goal is find a store result and shield bypass. If we do that, the boss fight should be should be quite smooth. We have whole repair drone and defense drone. We get result and shield bypass. I feel like this should be a really strong boss fight. Why not use Hermes against some of these heavy shield ships? Flax heavy two need to hit four shots. Yeah. I'm not firing my weapons much. That's the main that's my main answer. More like I'm so focused on the boarding that I'm like. I'm like trying to do these fights using no resources, you know, no hacking, no missiles. I should probably have this available though, so it can spin up. You thought the firing was just for training? We are getting a little training out of it, yes. That's That would be the answer I would say if I was not trolling. Um. true answer is I'm trying to conserve resources and I'm being lazy. That's my true answer. Conserve resources and laziness. Do they ever get out of here in time? Nope. <laughs> Free slug. I can get my pilot uh, immune to mind control. So I think that means I gotta get rid of Kletzkin here. Which sucks because that means I lose a lot of evasion. But we can start hopefully getting some evasion here. Dibs on the slug when Mimbola calls. You got it, sir. Uh, I think I said it before. You're not sure. Can it be that you like four mantis boarding? I may have said it once or twice. It's true. I may have said it once or twice. Slocknog is reserved, but nothing else is reserved. I'm going to check Mark Briggs off. Okay. Okay. We could have gotten so much more scrap this sector if it was just a slightly better layout. Still, 330 with that crappy layout, and I missed at least four jumps because of the layout. Okay, we have a potential uh, a Kazakh angle here. Okay. So we don't want distress for Kazakh. We want ship fights. We would need to get it pretty quickly. Of course, be able to get the second part of the quest. Slocknog, always in heavy demand. Such a hero. Such a hero, that Slocknog. Pry it open. It's fine. Just a quick dip in the refreshing clone booth bay thing. Kazakh is the Mantis Homeworlds quest that is my favorite reward in the game. It is a ship fight that if you crew kill and have... Teleporter plus level 2 Heal Bear Clone Bay or Sensors 3 plus level 2 Heal Bear Clone Bay gets you a free fully trained Mantis crew, high scrap gains, I think, a quest marker that gives you a free weapon, high amount of resources, and high scrap gains. It's two jumps for a lot of scrap gains. It's a lot of free stuff, basically. Flak. I could go double flak, heavy laser. Hmm. Hmm. Double flak, heavy laser instead of the Hermes. Oh, gosh. Let me think about the boss fight. If I hack shields... What's more likely... 
to get the, the missile offline. Hacking missile and shooting a missile at their missiles? Or hacking shields and, like, firing everything at missiles? Yeah, I feel like they're both good, and it's cheaper to get the flak online. I don't have to get my full weapon system online. I do need a lot to get that fully. I, I do need to consider that I have no cloaking, so I need fourth shield for phase two. Um, a lot of ship fights here. Is there anything I want to sell? How many How many jumps do I have? 11, so I just better buy all the fuel. This is probably still better right now, though. Wait, do I actually get 11 jumps? I don't, do I? Uh, 9, 10, 11. Okay, I can. I'm going to be here in 9, here in 8, here in 7, 6, 5, 4. Okay, yes. Hermes would be Hollow's way. Yeah, and it's good. I feel like... I don't want to fight that ship. Um, yeah, it would be good. I feel like they're both good. I don't... I don't know if mine is that is going to be any better. Cause thwack. Wrong cause. I feel like they're pretty comparable, honestly. I'm gonna have to lock them in. All right, we do have another ship fight here, so we have a bunch of mantis. We're gonna want to do this. Uh, maybe not you. You don't really go on the wiki. I recommend it if you want to learn the events. But some people find that to be cheating, so, you know. This run goes on for at least 30 minutes. We have no pause Wednesday. Uh, oh, is it almost midnight for you? Yeah, we're going definitely later than I normally do. We're already 30 minutes late, and we have another sector and a half to go. Okay. Alright, that's almost... All the weapons online. Ah, oh, man. No Kazakh, man. Man, man. Only two shields. Double bombs. That's a little sketchy, but we should still win this fight. So I'm not hacking. Beautiful. Ah, stun bomb. I think that was a stun and an ion bomb, actually. Okay, you guys. Rotating. Whoever gets lowest has to die. Sorry. You had to go this time, Zayachia. You don't actually play the game, Chestnut. You just watch. Advantage with missiles bombs to support boarding is basically that you can deprioritize weapon upgrades. With a breach bomb, too, you can run off... 12 weapons. Oh, level 2 weapons well into Sector 7. We have a great conventional weapons, so would want to upgrade anyway. Yeah. I, th I think I see what you're saying. The, uh, the weapon... If I had Hermes, I wouldn't need level 8 weapons. I could go with level 3 weapons and just Hermes down things while we're boarding is basically what you're saying, I think. Kazakh's an unmarked quest. Kazakh is at an uh, as as at a ship fight. Kazakh shows as a ship fight. Woof. Well, that's not Kazakh, but it's it's decent rewards. Go ahead and do the two low dudes. I think SD is kind of saying the opposite. Sleeping Dragon saying the opposite of you can get by with low weapon power. I thought he was saying the advantage was that you can use level two until sector seven. 
He's saying that with a good bomber missile, you don't need to upgrade weapons at all. Yeah, that's that's kind of what I understood. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Probably not getting Kazakh now, by the way. You killed me, used me, killed me many times, I'd say F this crew. Okay, no anti-personnel drone, but we're still going to do this. Lock him in there. Well, then don't volunteer to be on my ship, because <laughs> if we're boarding and we got clone bay, you're going to be dying. That's a, there's a tip for you. How much health did we gain from this? 25? Uh, yeah. You can delay the weapon upgrades. Once you have good weapons anyway, what else is there to buy? Well, like on this ship, I still need 4th shield, I still need 5th engine, I need level 3 teleporter. Like, there are a lot of things I would spend my scrap on that I would have gotten already if I hadn't gone into 9 power weapon or 7 power weapons. So, if I was just relying on Hermes, I could definitely see the advantage of not spending a bunch of scrap on weapons while I get my defenses up. My boarding support up and that kind of stuff. Lots of good stuff. Hacking stun, lifeform scanner, uh, distraction buoys. Oh man, look at all the stuff I could have bought. All right, I do need fourth shield again because I don't have Zoltan shield bite. I don't have uh, cloaking, so. Use my hacking drone so I don't have to use my defense drone. I'm never gonna get dodge training on this slug, by the way. <laughs> I just I'm crew killing everybody and hacking their weapons so they can't do damage. Who needs dodge training, I guess? Yeah, four shields is what Basically, my upgrades for defense for the boss fight is if I have cloaking, three shields, five dodge is good. If I don't have cloaking, four shields, five dodge is almost required. And that's what we had last run, and we barely survived. And I have a feeling the reason we did survive last time is because our defenses phase one and two, defenses phase one and two kept us from taking too much damage. And we lived with, what, seven health for the final boss uh, when we almost had the, you know, kill each other thing. Dodge train at Rebel Flagship. That's the play. Uh, this is actually a really good dodge training ship. Some heavy lasers? Okay, let's deal with the borders. Let them shoot at us a bit. Do I need to desync his weapons? I basically just need the halberd beam to be offline. Okay, perfect. Now, on fire. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna let them put the fire out. I'm gonna board in the weapons. Actually, no. As soon as they put the fire out, I'm gonna board in the shields. That'll pull them out of repairing that. And now they'll run back and forth while we get some training here. I might fire this for some weapon training. Oh, crap. I didn't mean to do that shot. Okay, good dodge. I'm going to wait till that guy comes out. Have I gotten any dodges yet? gotten about six so far well whoopsie <laughs> so much for the dodge training our crew killing is too strong store one two three four so this is another chance at uh zolton shield bypass 
I know, we're too good at murdering. Zone shield bypass. Sad. Okay, well, it is still nice to sell this. What do you all think? Zoltan Shield Bypass? I mean, uh, Long Range Scanner, Scrap Recovery Arm. Keep or no keep at the end of Sector 7? I lean towards keep because Sector 8 could be crazy scrap gains. But I could just get an extra 40 scrap from them. I think it's keep, keep. Can the man's ship with a weapon that jumps away in five seconds appear in home worlds? Uh, I don't know. Sounds like a keep. All right, let's keep it. Um, and I'm going to not spend my scrap on shields yet. Asteroid field. Oh, uh, you know what? I can afford uh, Zoltan Shield Bypass with that. Uh, you're going to head out in and I have a great night, my friend. We'll see you next time. Oh, God. Mind control most OP system. Ouch. Ouch. Ooh, here's some training. Here's some training. Chain laser plus... Asteroids for dodge training. Here we go. I need to actually dodge things, though. Did I breach the weapons? Did I? Let's check. I did. I would like to breach the mind control, because that'll be annoying. Okay. Damn. I think Asteroid finished him off when I wasn't wanting it to. Alright, um, we got... We're one dodge away from level 2 piloting. So that's okay. Or level 1, whatever you call it. Um, yeah, I got rid of the missiles. Hacking stun! There you go! I watch FTL, we got one of the best offense in the game. <laughs> Stupid hacking stun. Worst dogman in the game! Fight me! Okay, maybe not. Crystal... Well, Crystal Thing gets you 40 scrap. I don't know. Um, man, do I go into Repair City or down here for potential store? F yeah, most OP. Most OP, yeah. An augment that actively makes our boarding worse. I know, right? Repair. More chances at store. I think I need to high roll a store. I think you're memeing. I'm just gonna go get the repairs. We got drone parts, a little extra free scrap. We got our fifth dodge and power. The run's one. I think we need to ditch that stun. Um, is there a way to delete augments? You can't delete an augment, right? You can only sell it or replace it if you find another augment. So I need to very, I need to be very careful because yeah, if I if I board in the hacked room, that actually stuns my dudes. That might actually push you into a med bay hack phase one, you think? Stuns them all while killing them? Eh. Um, I mean, we're still probably going to hack missiles, right? Probably. Power, dodge, power. I don't want the teleporter upgrades. Actually, more than the repair, I want ship ice. Still hack missiles and just leave the room, yeah. Just stay in there and be stunned. Could do that. Well, we're killing the side rooms first. I think I should still hack missiles. Um, I'm a little unsure how I'm going to fully crew kill everybody, but I guess we'll figure it out. 
There's our dodge training. Breached weapons. Close hacking stun could be amusing to use with Lanius borders. Just repeatedly stun people in the room with no O2. What about a shield hack? Well, no. I need to kill the side rooms and then go kill out and kill the weapons. That's just the way to kill the missiles. That's just the way to go. Hackenstone could be amusing with Lanius borders, yeah. For three slot weapons, isn't that's about as good as it gets? Uh, Halberd Beam probably be slightly better, but yes, this is very, very, very good. Alright, so. Teleporter. Power. Level 2 backup battery, two more power, get me defense drone and all those online. Let's get, let's get one repair guaranteed for the drone parts. Okay. I might ha I might be diving if I take this and that gets taken over. And I might need to get some value points instead of more power. My, uh, secondary systems here. Boarding drone dead? Good. That was, a uh, that was not enough time, so we needed to crew kill. Of course, we were always, we we're always going to crew kill every time, so... Albert Beam lacks the satisfying sound of heavy laser smashing enemy ships. I agree. Sadly, it just does so much damage that it's kind of objectively better. Although there, there may you could probably argue there are situations where it's better. Heavy laser, but I, I think Halberd is just too stinking good. All right. Um. There's all the power except backup battery. I'm going to take the repair and hope this doesn't get taken over. There are many setups you would much prefer the heavy to, especially earlier on. Okay. Okay, good. It's not a dive. 50 scrap. I want the backup battery, I think. Don't worry, an empty jump. All right. Well, I think I take backup battery because that lets me have level three teleporter and level three hacking. So, what hack screws us this phase when we're trying to crew kill? What hack messes us up? Does teleporter hack mess us up? Does weapon hack mess us up? Does hacking hack mess us up? Maybe clone bay hack could get, cause some issues? TP hack is fine, clone bay hack would be awkward, okay. I think teleporter is annoying, but fine. Okay. All right, well, we let it through. That is a little scary to me, to be honest. And also makes it awkward to get in here, honestly. Oh god, he just ioned my defense drone, man. Whoops, shouldn't have fired that. We do take this missile shot. God damn it, backup battery bullshit. Uh. Okay, that's busted. Okay. Uh, I need to bring you guys back. I'm very slow right now. Okay, fix the breach, though. Go here. Stops the repair. I'm leaving this broken. I'm just leaving it broken right now. Try to kill a clone bay cooking. Okay. Damn it. 
hard to put who I want in here. Okay. Um. Okay, now I can clone safely. Stop that. Uh, my O2 is down. Whoops. Whoops. It's fine, it's fine. Whew, okay. No, it's fine, it's fine. There's no problems. All right, how many crews do you have left? Three. Okay. Ah, one health left on that guy. Okay. All right. Uh, we just slow play this. This is fine. Let's kill one more guy. Um, let him in and then close the door. There. Now we go here. Killing my crew. All right. Three damage, but all crew dead. I don't have Zoltan Shield Bypass. Don't have Zeldon Shield Bypass. Yeah, Oxygen, I know, I know. <laughs> I was, that was a bit of a troll play. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, who needs to be vented? You two, so I guess I'm going to do this. I fix the vent there. Okay, good. We don't have the mind control counter, and we don't have Zoltan Shield Bypass. That makes it a little sketchier, I feel like. Now it would be really nice if I did have a Beam Drone to get through the Zoltan Shield quicker phase 3. The AI of the cattle ship does repair auto repair facilities. I'm pretty sure it does. Sadly. All right, um, let's use one hull repair. That sucks, yes it does. It's annoying. All right, so we're gonna insta-board missiles. Hack shields, shoot shields, right? Insta-board missiles, have our second group of guys run to piloting. Hack shields, shoot shields. I think that's what we're gonna do here. It doesn't repair breaches though, like auto scouts. I'll repair. Three damage? You mean zero damage? Right, it's totally a zero damage phase one. Alright, let's wait it out. No more scrap we can get, really. Check the heavy two at missiles and flak at shields. Doesn't, uh... Doesn't insta-boarding missiles phase two kill the missiles before they can fire? I thought that was a thing with boarding, right? As long as I insta-board missiles... Missiles don't fire. Yeah, yeah, it's phase three that we'd need to maybe throw something there. Okay. Defense drone, oh, uh, defense drone even killed the boarding thing, that's awesome. Oh, that's not a good place for him, though. Okay. Actually, I want to kill this laser. Because if that fires during the drone phase, that can be bad. That should be GG for that phase. Zero damage phase two for real. Nice. Get blasted, bro. Get freaking blasted. Thank you, Mike Copley. Appreciate that. Okay, so we don't have any borders to deal with. We do have our max trained mantis getting mind controlled to deal with. However, 
if a mantis does get mind controlled, that's good for us because we just kill him and respawn him, I think. So we have to get through the Zoltan shield first anyway. Uh, I can see why you like having actual weapons on a boarding ship, yeah. No damage phase 3, very unlikely, because uh, we can't get the missiles offline immediately. 47 scrap gets us... Door value, maybe? Sure. Alright, we follow just in case something bad happens. Do I need to move any of my crew? Basically, whoever gets mind controlled, we insta destroy with our mantis. And respawn them. So one of these crew, we do it, it's fine. Okay. Okay, it's our NG. Poor NG. About to get destroyed. Just deleted this NG. Feels bad, NG. Oh, that's a fire, though. Okay, NG can fix it. Okay, we're through. Oh, okay. It's fine. Okay, no more dodges. Missiles offline. I'll turn on hull repair while I don't have a defense drone to use. Let's hit mind control. Beautiful. All right. You know what? Let's uh, let's BM him. I'm gonna kill you by boarding. Death by boarding here. I'm BMing the boss, everybody. Flawless victory. Took zero damage. And bam! Mantis B wrecked by four man Mantis boarding. Board shame him. He hit me for one damage right there at the end. GG, my friends. That is 10 in a row. That is tied for my second best streak ever. That is tied for my second best streak ever. Progress. We're making progress. Oh, it feels so good to make progress. It feels good to make progress. Boarding OP, man. Let's check that score. 55, 56. 1804, scrap collected, 104 beacons, 43 ships defeated. It's been a long time since we got a true streak going. That's right. We're over a third of the way towards our goal, my, goal, my friends. Thank you, Mike Hoff. We appreciate that. Confirmed. Uh, your boy Boomstick in chat blesses Ron. Confirmed. All right, my friends. Well, we've gone almost an hour late, but hey, it's worth it. We have a streak of 10. Quick reminder, no stream tomorrow. Sadly, I got to, uh, well, not sadly. Excitingly, <laughs> I get to go do a singing gig tomorrow. That's going to be a lot of fun, but it means I can't stream. I might start doing Tuesdays as my salt day, FTL, Harma, no pause all day. That way, if I need to go late, I can, and I'm not stressed about my rehearsal coming up. So probably next week we'll start doing Tuesdays as our FTL Harma no pause day. So thank you for the bits, Mr. Bread Baps. Thank you for the follow, follow insubordinate helper. Um, good seeing in tomorrow. Appreciate that. Axolotl. Um, but my friends, you all are amazing. Thank you for all the people who are here. 100 bits from Hugzer. Y'all, the support is amazing. When I play FTL, I might be salty, but you all come out to support and I really appreciate it. So as I always say, thanks for all the bits, the follows, the subs, the gift the subs, lurking, the hanging out, all the awesome stuff. I hope you all have a great rest of your night. So until next time, peace out, happy gaming. I will see you all on Thursday. Have a great night. Later, my friends.